The Minister of Health, Honorable Jen Ruth Acheng, has revealed that the spread of a Ebola outbreak could have been dealt with quicker had village health teams or VHTs been more vigilant and reported to the ministry earlier. Sorry, eight people died in the community. Why is the VHT not there? When we lose two weeks, it is a little too many. Because the contacts are many, and yet we need to pick them early. So next time, please be on your toes. Any deaths in the community, report. Don't keep quiet. Even if you think it is malaria, report it. She said that COVID made people poor and urged people to join the fight to avoid a repeat. Like I said before, COVID made people poor. We want to live our lives peacefully. Our strength in controlling this epidemic depends on you and the communities. And the VHDs, you are our strength. So my appeal to you to talk to the people in your area, tell them, this Ebola is real, it exists, and stopping it depends on me and you. A Chang dispelled wrong thinking that there were lockdown restrictions in place. Movement. You are free to move. Number two, children should go to school. Anybody who has closed school, tell them it is wrong. Schools must remain open. And the primary seven pupils, senior four, senior six, must do their exams. We are not closing any markets. We are not closing any shops. Continue with your businesses. The minister insisted that cooperation was the key in the fight against Ebola. But cooperate with us. Cooperate with us. Cooperate with us. And I have said it three times, we need cooperation. How do we need your cooperation? If you know of a case of Ebola, report. If you know of a person who has had contact with that person who had Ebola, report. Have contact yourself, hand yourself over. Because when we start giving you treatment early, your chances of survival are higher. Ebola moves through contact. Meaning you have to have contact with the person who has Ebola and you touch the body fluids. Or if the body fluids are spilled on the ground, you get into contact with it. During this time of COVID, we have said no hand shaking. Please don't shake hands. Please. Even with Ebola here, yeah, don't shake hands. Even let us avoid having, because we want to continue with our lives, not so. So if you cooperate with us, everything will be okay. Now the VHTs, you move door to door. People with the fever and any sign of Ebola report. For me, I'm not going to lie, I was a little disappointed that people started dying in Madutu some time back. But only for us to get information on the 19th. Why? 